they're all sad. And away they go to a perfect start. Zenyatta, though, as usual, not in any intention of going to the lead. Mike Smith taking her back dead last early. Lethal Heat, meanwhile, is sprinting away up front to Champagne Eyes, and Harbour's Creation's going to settle into the third spot. Dawn After Dawn is in fourth. They're flying along on the lead, which means this field is really getting strung out here. Tidal Dance is back third last. Then we come back to Life is Sweet, and Zenyatta just loping along at the back. Zenyatta gives them a good 13-length start in the early stages. On to the back stretch they go now, and Lethal Heat is comfortably in front now, nice and relaxed. Jockey just took a peep back there. They lead it by a length and a half. In the second spot is Champagne Eyes. Inside of that comes a Narba's Creation. Dawn After Dawn is fourth, no more than three lengths off the leaders. Then back to Tidal Dance. Behind that comes Life is Sweet, and Mike Smith just still sitting dead, still on Zenyatta. Head just bobbing along at the back. They've moved up a little closer now. Zenyatta's eight lengths off the lead. They head to the 3 8 pole, and Lethal Heat continues to show the way now. Champagne Eyes, Dawn After Dawn on the far side. Down at the rail and Narba's creation. In behind that comes Tidal Dance. Now here comes Life is Sweet with her run. And let's see, Zenyatta, Mike Smith starting to shake the reins at her now. And Zenyatta's lengthening her stride. Zenyatta's going to hook to the grandstand side now. They come for home. Lethal Heat is the leader. Dawn After Dawn and Narba's creation. And Zenyatta on the grandstand side continues to come at them stride for stride. Lethal Heat holding on to it though. Lethal Heat and Narba's creation. Zenyatta so close. I think Zenyatta got up a nose, but it's really close.